Hey everyone, this is Yogesh. Welcome to my channel, Utilize Your Business. And in this video, I'm going to be doing a ClickFunnels tutorial on how to add products to your funnel inside ClickFunnels. Helping out everybody who's having a little bit hard time how to add products. So stick around till the end of the video and you'll have everything you need to know how to add products to your funnel inside ClickFunnels. Let's go. Welcome back. So I'm going to assume that you guys already have your Stripe account already set up. If not, you need to have your Stripe account set it up so you can take payments uh, through ClickFunnels. So the second thing, while well, I'm going to be assuming it that it is a, um, you know, it's an order form. So that's where you add your product. So assuming that you've done these two steps, I'm just going to tell you how to add a product inside your order form so once you have the order form right there if you look at it you'll have the products so you click on there and it will just tell you how to add a uh, product to the funnel step and it's going to tell you step by step how to do it so the first thing you do is click and add a product well uh, in this case I already have my stripe account uh, click one so you click on that uh, so either it's you want to know they want to know what it is and this for this tutorial i'm going to assume that it's a one-time uh, payment so one time and uh, right there so save and next and then you need to name a product so whatever it is the the product that you want to name it i name it um this is this is uh, I'm just doing a test so that I'll just do a test product and what it is you know say 997 and it's in USD so here you can just put how will the display with a dollar sign and exactly the way it is shipping since it is going to be digital product i'm not going to be shipping out so i'm going to leave this myself billing description this is where you want to uh, describe what the product is so you can say um ebook on how to get leads okay so i believe so you can just put ebook how to get leads and this will actually appear on the uh, person who actually their credit um, the credit card uh, billing so they actually know where it is so you can put ebook and actually you can put uh, maybe a name of the funnel or if it's uh, if it's under the business you can just put a business so I can put just a test funnel or something so at least they will remember like oh yeah I bought the product now this is since this product is not a bump so i'll leave it at this but if by any chance if you have your order form that and also a bump product so you need to uh, go through the same step to and then just to uh, make this turn this on or enable this so it will be a bump product so right and then you go to save and next uh create a product variance no so we'll leave it at that create, save and less uh so so you want uh click funnels to send an email or you're going to send an email to a third party uh autoresponder if you have uh, active campaign a or whatever so what i can do is i usually have uh click funnels send a, a full, fulfillment email so and there this is where you just put uh, so congratulate on your purchase and you just put a body you know just write a simple and you know congratulation here it is and in this uh, example it is a digital product so you just um, uh, put a link here somewhere in the email that they where they can download the uh, actually a product right and this is where you can be or you can go to you know wherever your thank you page is your thank you page should be here URL so we'll just go to save and next and now this is for the people who are on 297 plan 
So I'm assuming that people who are not in 297 plan, 97 plan, so you don't do any of the follow, um, follow up action. Save. Uh, this is not a physical product, so okay, the product was saved, and that's about it. Now, the the other thing you can do is if you guys don't have, like I said, you don't have the follow up uh, funnels, but if you can, there there's another option you can do as well. You can have the follow up. And if you're on Aweber or on an active campaign, any of those two, you can just click on it rather than the click funnel. So you can click on Aweber and, you know, and then you can put tags or, you know, ingrade the existing form in it. If you go to active campaign, uh, which is why I like the active campaign and where you can actually have the tags from the click funnels goes to the active campaign you can just say you can um, add to the list add to the list with a tag um, and also you can do this but what I do is add to a list with a tag so I click on this and whatever my list says just pick one and whatever the tag is tag could be uh, bot uh, bot uh, test product right so this is the tag and the list whatever list you want to pick on there and you can just go save and next so that's it guys it's so easy to use it so just follow up step by step I know the first time you're doing it it's a little bit uh, nerve-wracking but uh, believe me it's easy just follow this um, this video tutorial and you'll have your product added to your uh, sales funnels in no uh, no time thanks guys